down. Jazzy's yes, the last man with a chance to catch Yanni Virgil's score of seven reps in a time of 107.71 seconds. Well, he's got more body weight than Yanni, but he's a couple inches taller at 6'6". His leverage is just not favorable to pull this big weight. Dave Oslin from Minnesota stands six foot six inches tall. A true giant. God, if we watch his hips, he's not getting them down. He's using a lot of back. The hips are down, you can use your leg strength. So now he has to slide it up his thighs and ask his hips to drive him forward. And he's re-gripping there, Kaz, in the middle with 75 pounds. Very much resting on his knees. That was incredible to be able to change grip and lock out. Truly innovative. A thinking strongman. Seven fifty proves to be too much. So American Dave Awesome with a strong performance. Six reps at 45.59 seconds, but it's Yanni Virtanen who rebounds to win the deadlift. Bill Kazmaier standing by with Dave Oslin, who finishes third. Dave, third place in the event. But the real story is that sixth lift. You switch your hand. I've never seen anybody do that before. Yeah, I just, I knew I needed that sixth rep. Now my grip was slipping a little the right hand that was under, and I had it resting on my knees. But I just flipped it over and hooked it. Didn't think about it, just did it. That's using all the best you've got. Keep it up. Thanks, guys. Yanni Virton in seven reps in 107.71 earns him the win in five points. Kevin Nee and Dave Oslin each have six reps, but Nee gets a better time. Jessen Pollen finishes fourth, and Suavik Toychek is fifth. Yeah, it's amazing how tight this group is bunched together. Any one of these five athletes can claim the two spots in the final. Well, Kaz, in this competition, that is an unbelievable amount of weight to put in the hands. 353 pounds in each hand, Todd. That's 706 trying to split your body in half. The trick is to hold on, go to that happy place, and have intense concentration. He will surpass the 32nd mark. How much longer can he go? This is Jessen Pollen from Canada. Cass. I thought at 30, 35 seconds he was about cooked. He looks so relaxed. There he is. Almost bored. Having some fun with the crowd. And now the pain really starts to kick in. Will he surpass one minute? He's done it. Just over one minute for the Canadian Jessen Paulin. is going to be a tough mark to beat. A little showmanship from the Canadian when Justin Paulin wakes up from this little slumber. He sees that he posts a time of 1 minute 0.37 seconds. He's now with Bill.